this is Deanna Bailey with Build One X and Build Coin, and we've got Scott Moberg here, and we're going to talk a little bit about what he feels blockchain technology can actually do within the construction industry. So, hi, Scott. It's good to see you. Hi. Thanks for having me. Yeah. Why don't you tell us a little bit about who you are, what you do, what you do within the industry? Uh, I'm a current uh, custom home builder, semi-custom home builder in the Denver market, and uh, I've owned my company since 2004. And uh, we're currently uh, just facing the everyday problems that builders have, especially with financing projects. Yeah, yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> that's a good one. We all like financing. So historically, uh, how has technology improved the construction industry, and and what what kind of an impact do you think blockchain may actually have on it? Well, I think if we stay high level, uh, quite frankly, technology I think hasn't really affected the construction industry for the most part just because the, the construction industry hasn't embraced technology as much as other industries have. So I'm kind of excited to hear new ideas on whether it's for financing or operations or all kinds of technology and construction. Um, Buildcoin and what you guys are doing here is, is definitely a key element to that that I'm excited to learn more about. Yeah, no more checks, right? Exactly. It's horrible. <laughs> Who still uses checks? <laughs> it's so bad. So as an industry veteran, uh, do you think builders are ready to embrace this technology? In their in their current roles or uh, I, w I would say there's gonna be a challenge there um, for the most part in the construction industry as I mentioned I think um, builders are reluctant to take on and embrace technology uh, there's this mentality of let's uh, let's do it the way we've always done it in construction but I think um, the the demographic of the leaders in the construction industry uh, have gotten to the point where they are the younger generation is in leadership roles and I'm seeing that door open up a little bit more now. There's There are some new fresh ideas in construction more than there was 10, 15 years ago. Yeah, those millennials. Star millennials. They, and they know more, right? <laughs> yeah, and yeah. My kids are always like, Mom, you can't. I'm like, just do it. Just do it for me. Exactly. <laughs> so how is the current state of construction, funding and payments impacting the industry from your perspective? And have you seen it prohibit growth? I definitely have. So the typical, everyone knows in construction, you got typically a monthly or bi-monthly draw process with a bank or some sort of lender. Um, a lot of paperwork involved in that, and I guess what I'm interested in learning is other options of you know making that process a little bit more efficient. Um, there's a lot of technology going on with what I would call electronic currency that I think uh, could probably help some of that. How much do you think we could save on the overall construction process if payments were all digital and in real time? That's that's a hard question to answer, I guess. It depends on the interest rate, I guess, that you're getting from your current bank. But if you can speed things up and make things more real time, I would imagine you're saving 10, 15 percent on a project, maybe something like that. Yeah, and a lot of headaches. An awful a lot, lot of headaches. headaches. <laughs> <laughs> so what makes this a unique solution in such an already established industry? I think it's a unique solution just because because of that, it is unique. Um, the industry is set in the ways that it's always had for years and years, and I think this is just a fresh new idea that uh, has been embraced by other industries, and now it's time for the construction industry to take a look at it. Yeah. You guys are far behind. <laughs> Big time. Catch yes. up. That'll be the first Catch minute. <laughs> so could blockchain technology potentially help lower the cost of construction and potentially help lower the inflation of the housing market? Uh, I, I would imagine it would. I guess I don't know enough about it at this point, but anything that increases the efficiency of getting people paid and not tying up as much money as you need to at one one time, I think yeah, it only can help, right? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so is there anything else you'd like to add to your thoughts on this project or how you feel about it? Uh, I'm excited to see what you guys come up with. I think it's, it's cutting edge stuff that you guys are doing and uh, I definitely want to be uh, a part of it and uh, see you guys grow. Yeah, great. Well, thank you for, for being here. It was great having you. Thank you.